Who's at the helm? I have the manuscript. Great. Hope is waiting for you in Sleepy Hollow. What's in Sleepy Hollow? Benjamin Franklin. The man Johnson hired to make that strange precursor box work. So what's the plan? Meet Hope. Impersonate one of Johnson's men. And get the box and manuscript to Franklin. So I'm a messenger then. Aye. Right. See if this Franklin can figure out how this damn box operates. Stay with him. Oh, as far as we can tell, this man doesn't know about the tempers or the assassins of that man. Oh, a simple task. <laughs> For a simple man. Let's all sail. Let go, anchor. Captains at sea. Cameron did conspire to return the exiled Charles Edward Stuart to the throne. This lackey of the so-called Bonnie Prince Charlie was drawn on a sledge, hanged for 20 minutes, cut down and beheaded. Gentlemen, ladies, and good citizens within the sound of my voice, there is a plague of wild hair about. These creatures are devouring so much grain that the very crops that sustain our community are in great... I think you've had enough! A handsome reward will be paid. Any man, woman... <laughs> Oh, 
think the French may have a stronger arm. That'll do, and how. We're late. The sky is getting temperamental. That's not the only thing, is it? Uh, Master Franklin, sir. My name is Shay, and this is my associate Hope. Uh, William Johnson told us to give you these. Ah. Thank you, but I'm afraid I must delay my experiment. Delay it? Why? The army confiscated my lightning rods. They are essential to conducting the electricity. I need to vivify your box. Master Johnson would not want you to have to wait. Perhaps there is something you can do, then. Soldiers have been hauling things away all day. Perhaps they could tell you where they've taken my lightning rods so you could get them back. At your service, sir. Begin your investigation at the market near the docks. I will stay here and help with the preparations. This is intolerable. I can barely conduct my research anymore. Everyone is having metal co- Gated nowadays. Yes. Yes. The army will melt it down and...
I'm sure you're seeing things. I wonder what Master Franklin plans to do with these rods. The storm's getting worse. Better hurry back to Franklin.
Okay, thank goodness. Uh, quick, help me with the rods. Portugal, Lisbon, I'd stake my life on it. Make yourself scarce, Shay. The militia will be here any minute. I'm sure they will have questions. What about you? I'm a devoted housekeeper. Right. The nearest bureau is near Mount Vernon. Hope will be expected me. A pleasure. See you next time.
on your mind, Captain. Later then. Lisbon is near as large as London or Paris. Are you sure you can find this one place? Saw it clear as day, Hope. It's a convent, right close by the harbor. I might have visited the sisters once or twice. Given your present knowledge of the site, this duty falls upon you. You understand what must be done? Find the Precursor Temple and retrieve the Peace of Eden. Finally obtained a ship for crossing the ocean. Have no worries. I will keep the Morrigan safe in New York. Thank you. Liam and I will leave straight away. Liam is unavailable at present. Your crew and ship await. Be careful, Shay. Pieces of Eden are powerful relics. Feast of all saints. What a sight. And here I am, looking for a relic from the time before Adam and Eve. 
Strange days indeed. Benedictus est, Domine, Deus Universi, quia de tua largitate acepimus vinum, quo tibi offerimus, fructum vitis et operis manum hominum, ex quo nobis fiet potus spiritalis. In nomine Patris, et Fili, et Spiritus Sancti. Gratia Domine. Domine Iesu Christe, qui dixisti apostolis tuis, pacem relinquo bobis, pacem meam to bobis. Ne respicias pecata nostra, sed fidem ecclesia et tuae. Eam que secundum contratem tuam, pacificare et quadunare digneris, qui vivis et regnas in saecula saeculorum. Amen. 
This must be it. The precursor site. What do we have here? The artifact.
do this to them? God had nothing to do with this. So what's the next city you want me to smite? What happened in Haiti happened in Portugal. A great earthquake. Thousands dead thanks to your damned manuscript. This cannot be. Jay, a person cannot start an earthquake. A person meddling with these precursor machines could. You saw the box, Hope. The temple was filled to bursting with that kind of power. You made me slaughter innocents. How dare you? You defend him? Achilles sent me in there like Machandal sent his man in Haiti. What the he hell's knew. going on? Stop this! The operation was delicate. Perhaps you... you are shifting the earth itself. Who are you to decide what city falls next? Get him out of here. Liam is a fool if he thinks I'll leave this be. Achilles cannot be trusted. He must never find another Precursor Temple. I don't care that he's Mentor, or that his family is dead. There's no excuse for this level of madness. Only one thing to do. There's no turning back now. I had such hopes for you, Shay. Achilles, I have to do this. And what is it you're doing exactly? Stealing from your brothers. Betraying me. Someone must make amends. Make amends? You have no idea what you're doing. The future of the whole continent, maybe the whole world, is tied up in that manuscript. Perhaps. But we don't have the right to decide that future. The right? We have the responsibility! We are responsible for killing innocents and destroying cities. This mad grab for power. It ends now. I will not let you destroy everything we have built! Assassins! Stop him! Stop Shay! Chevalier is using mortars to stop. 
That's enough. Give back the manuscript, Shay. I'm sure Achilles... I cannot! I will not let this happen again. All those souls lost. One more hardly matters. Shay! <laughs> Glitch in the memories. There seems to be more data. Okay, Numskull. I can't pull you out of the chair right now. You'll just have to see this through. This is bizarre. These memories seem to take place some 20 years after the one we just saw. Are you certain? Positive. This means... Shay must have survived that fall. If he is the man I believe him to be, then he has. Keep going. The data is fragmented. This memory is incomplete. Let me see what I can do. Listen up. We need to find out what Shay's up to. This memory's gonna look a little rough. But I'm like 90% sure sequencing this memory won't kill you. All right, now, sir. We don't know where she is or what he's doing now. So keep your eyes and ears open. I want to know the reason Shay came to this place. You heard the man. Let's move.
Et alors Vous l'avez trouvé Ouais, Benjamin Franklin est à Notre-Dame. Si on se magne, on devrait le rattraper. Arrêtez de vous branler Allons-y Benjamin Franklin. That's who she is after. Franklin traveled to England and France. And that guy said Notre Dame. Shame must be in Paris. Time to show me what you got. Eliminate the threat. Protect Franklin. Cette fois. Shit. What happened? That's all the data we have. We can't explore this memory further. For now. Shay couldn't have died, then appeared in France 20 years later. We're missing something. Shay's memories are scattered in chunks throughout the cloud. The servers are messed up from the virus, so we can't access all of Shay's life at once. Otto Berg. You'll find him squatting in one of the offices. Shay Cormac is an assassin. But he is unlike the ones you have used for your entertainment products in the past. I believe Shay may be the most important assassin who ever lived. Your research will help me achieve something I have wanted for a very long time. Shay's story may have something to offer you as well. There's another server we can access to get to the next chunk of Shay's memories? Excellent. I'm gonna need the numbskull back if we're gonna proceed. Your next task is clear. But please reflect. I got tired of waiting for Melanie's stupid repair crew, so I got this piece of shit working well enough to get you to the lobby and back. I'll get your animus prepped while you're downstairs. I've added the location to the next server on your map. Get going. security lock. I have granted you level one security clearance. I trust there will be no further delays. Great. Now you can get into the server room. Once you restore the servers, I'll load the next set of Shay's memories to your animus.
All points ready. Begin. Go, go, go! Who are you? Don't you touch her! Oh, for God's sake, restrain him! You, give me the child. Oh, shush now. You're all right. Elena, Calm down, Mr. Berg. I promise you I won't hurt your daughter. Who are you? My name is Warren Vidic. I work for Abstergo Industries. You quit the Uti Yaga Regiment and became a freelance mercenary in order to afford better care for Elena's cystic fibrosis. How is that working out for you? Arkane! I have an offer for you. I don't work for people I don't know. It's not that kind of offer. I'm going to remove an item from my pocket. What is that? This little pill? <laughs> it's actually for her. Go on, little one. Have some medicine. Stop! There now. All points ready. Begin. Go, go, go! Who are you? Don't you touch her! Oh, for God's sake, restrain him! Great job, Nuskull. Data we have is pretty raw, but it's enough to move forward. Get back up here. Double time. It looks like restoring servers also clears the virus from some of the other systems. You are making excellent progress. I am eager to see what Shay will show us next. Level 1 clearance will also let you into some of the other parts of the building as well, if you need to stretch your legs in between animus sessions. If I said that was the craziest shit I'd ever seen, would that be the most obvious statement ever? Shay has been through a severely traumatic experience. Okay. Second most obvious statement ever. Continue exploring his memories. The best is yet to come. Good to see you're feeling better. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Finnegan, was it? Sweet Mother Mary. Have we taken in the village idiot? Barry! Remember, Shay, I'm Cassidy, and this is... Barry! You've been ill for weeks. I hate to have been a burden. 
See? He's a civilized fella. Aye, for a clumsy deckhand. Probably fell off his ship half drunk. Barry! He's right. What do y'all want? <gasps> What's going on? Woman. Ow! Leave her alone. Ow! Now, what are you going on about? Stay out of this, you fool! Well, I was going to, but now you've made things personal. I hope you put up an excellent fight. I need a child. Thank you, Shay. In my younger days, I could have taken them one-handed. Why were these men bothering you? Ah, oh, the usual. They feel they're owed money because they're not harming citizens. Mark me words, those gangs are going to be the downfall of this city. Wait here, I have something for you. It won't do you any good walking around Starkers. Here, try these on. They were our sons. I suppose if you're looking for trouble, you'll be needing these. Thank you. Don't you look a right gentleman? Gas. Did I have a book with me? Mm, just those peculiar weapons. Thank you both. If you'll excuse me. And the manuscript is at the bottom of the Atlantic. What have you and your friends got against the Finnegan? Uh, I got no gripe. I, my boss sent me over. Ah. And where is he set up? Y you can't miss it. There's always black smoke rising from the courtyard of that building.
help with smoke? Be at ease, Master Cormac. We are friends. The Finnegans were worried you might take matters into your own hands. I am Colonel George Monroe. Colonel? I came to help, but I see I am late. Thank you for dealing with these foul criminals. They were a blight on New York. What do you care? You redcoats are nothing but landlords. The townsfolk here are grinding away, trying to make a living. I cannot blame you for having that impression. Some of my comrades have been less than helpful. But I take a different approach. And what is that? I care. I want to see these colonists safe and prosperous. Noble words. Perhaps actions will convince you otherwise, Master Cormac. Here. Reclaim what they have stolen. Now let us use some of that money for the good of the city. I realize you have no reason to trust me, Master Cormac. You said you were a friend of the Finnegans. I am. Their late son. Working. You are much like him. Oh, so? He cared. And he wanted to do good by the people. We shared a dream, he and I. That of making the world a better place. Mere survival is not enough. Full bellies, warm clothing. Freedom from want is the greatest freedom of all. It almost sounds like you have goodwill towards the people you govern. I do not govern, Master Cormac. I merely assist. Richard Patrick did willfully and repeatedly commit the crime of sleeping in on the Lord's See this neglected edifice, Master Cormac? We can make it better. Urban renewal is a new science, but one that has already proven effective on the continent. I have arranged for resources. Use them to improve that building. What a fine work! The neighborhood would be much better now. I suspect New York will prosper under your watch, Master Cormac. You can do great things for this city and its citizens. After all, a man needs purpose. Farewell for now, Master Cormac.